Hey everybody, I'm coming from you, to you once again with this month's Apple Picks um, from my camper here. And we're right now in San Antonio, Texas here. Uh, yesterday I got to go to the Central Market, which has one of the widest selections of apples outside of Farmer's Market that I've been to. Um, it's, a comp it's a small series of, series of chain stores here in Texas that is owned by bigger chain, um, HEB. I'm just going to like the more upscale stores, more similar to Whole Foods. So as I was to here, it gave me a good idea of what apples are going to be available in the market right now. And for March, March is not that exciting anymore. You know, there's nothing new really coming out now. Everything is you know, older from last year. Um, all the newer winter varieties that, that come in the winter are all, all been out now. So there's nothing really to get excited about, honestly. Um, right now, it's just all about, this time of year, it's all about trying to find the most crisp apples that you can come up with um, that, that still have some furnish crispness to them here. Um, so... Um, I'm going to give you a peek into what we are eating right now. So let me just take you over and show you what's in our fruit drawer. All right, guys, we're going to open up the apple drawer and show you what we actually currently have right now. So right now we are eating some Snapdragon apples. We got some Evercrisp apples from New York, from Fowler Farms. We also, back here, let's see what else we got here. We got a Cosmic Crisp Apple here. Um, really, really large size ones, although I think the smaller ones taste better, but it's what they had at the Walmart at that time. And I think there's another variety back there, too. I see a Granny Smith back there, because my daughter, oldest daughter, really likes tart apples here, so a lot of the apples that are I'm eating right now aren't very tart. Um, but also back here, we got a little tiny guy hiding back here. We got a Rocket. My um, three-year-old um, can't eat a normal size apple so we get these little ones for her and so she isn't wasting as much so there's a kind of a live peek into our um apple fruit drawer here some citrus in there as well of course all right guys you got a peek at what apples we got going on right now here um so we have some cosmic crisps that we're doing we got rock rocket we um snapdragon um which aren't as crisp as i was hoping right now and um we had some other crisp so in terms of Apples to look out from the store. Evercrisp is staying pretty crisp. It's a very sweet apple. It's a cross between Honeycrisp and Fuji. Um, but it's it's plenty crisp right now. It has some flavor to it. Um, snap, as I said, Snapdragons were a little softer than I wanted them to be here. Still, okay. Well, not bad. Um, but right now, March is not really the prime of year for apples anymore. Uh, we're starting to, to see whatever's available is there now. And nothing new is really going to roll out until we get into more into May and June. And we start seeing apples from New Zealand come over here. Um, so right now you just kind of, when I say go to the store, you just kind of look for what apples um, are going to be the most crisp right now here. Um, and it, and those are what's it right now. It's just the time you we're getting into. Um, you can also look for um, Jazz and Kiku are two other ones out there um, that might um, be all right too. Kiku's still pretty crisp too, but um, they're okay in flavor here. Nothing super spectacular here. Um, also, if you can find Wild Twist, um, I'm seeing it more on the hers being shown more on the east coast, which is Pink Lady and Honey Crisp Cross. That's really good. Um, I would definitely go with those here. Um, but right now, yeah, it's just um, time of year right now is not the prime apple season here. Um, just enjoy what you can right now, and um, things will eventually get a little more exciting eventually again here. But we're kind of entering that that doldrum period now, where you just you just gotta find the um, the best one. I uh, don't eat as many apples. I use this time in this time of year. Um, still definitely still eating lots of citrus, and eventually in May, uh, when cherries and peaches and stuff come in, I'll kind of shift more to those and don't really eat as many apples here. Um, but that's kind of what's uh, going on with apples right now. Um, guys, leave some comments say, saying what you're finding and loving right now here. Maybe there's something out there that you guys love and I need to share too. So, um, that's kind of what's, uh, rolling for March here. So, we'll, uh, see you next month.